What to do YouTube and I'm back with a 2K21 demo build video. So today I'll be showing you all the top five point guards in Emir 2K21. Uh not including um it's called next gen, but this is current gen. So and I'm sorry for the music in the background, I can't fucking turn it off. 2K does have an option to turn it off in the demo, which kinda sucks. So let's get right into it. So at number five, it was a build last year that was really, really dominant. And let me just go to it. It's this build, the two-way slasher playmaker. This build has been specifically nerfed. So let's just get into it. Um, max speed, of course. Um, why not? And then while you're upgrading this, um, if you look at it, you don't get contact dunks, which is really, really interesting. So when you're icing with this build you only really don't have a lot of options now because you don't have contact dunk so you can't really drive to the rim you have the defense and playmaking but the three ball is okay there all someone has to do is really press up on you and you are kinda suck so continue, I'm gonna continue with this build so you go 663 um, in the playmaking this that and then defense 85 85 91 and I, I upgrade my defensive rebound now I'd take off some from playmaking to make it 20 and Okay, I can't take that off All right, That's stuck there and then only eight finishing which is kind of depressing. I'm not gonna lie um, Eight finishing and depressing okay, and I put the last two so 8 11 20 17 last year it was um, I believe it 10 11 20 and 20 or 11, 10, 20, and 20. Uh, so it doesn't matter. But you can make this build tall, I'm pretty sure. You can go lowest weight, um, also lowest wingspan. Uh, I guess you make it 6'5, I'm pretty sure. Yep, you can make it 6'5. Maybe it's 6'6, six, six, then you can't make it 6'6. Six, six. But 6'5, six, I mean, you're talking about the stats. I mean, you have pretty good defense, right? You, you also have like 17 batters, pretty sure. Your playmaking, so you can speed boost off rip. Your three ball is pretty good especially with a 99 point boost you'll get to 70 but that driving dunk really holds you back because you're not really good at uh, using screens because your three ball is so and your dunk is so low so when your eyes swing you really have nowhere to go unless someone's just dumb and leaves you wide open then you can probably win but if someone knows what they're uh, doing and they press up on you you're kind of screwed because you don't have a contact dunk so yeah and then take over if you're doing this build, I'll personally do lock take. A play take, I mean, if your teammates need it, but I think play takes, it's kind of, it's, it, it, it's okay. It's not the best. Or you can go slashing take, which we can help you, but those two takeovers would be good. Okay, the next build, I'm going with the Peter Playmaker, the Peter Orange one. Now, this one does have its um advantages. It's the tallest build you can make as a point guard. Um, which is really good. So, uh, so 75 ball, you gotta go here and get 16. Move this down a little bit, extra attributes, and then go to playmaking, you get 9, 29. Might as well just get 30 in there. Uh, then your defense, got upgrade there. I kind of forgot to do the dunk. Okay, you got 6 finishing, which is really not good. I sure believe this, if you make the right height, could get contact dunks. I'm pretty sure. I think you can like 6'5, you can make out contact dunks. I must be tripping. And then you go down. You can take some attributes off. I'll put this maybe up here. And then maybe just put it down there. So you get five different badges. So now, if you look at the build, you have good playing again, right? You immediately spoof yourself for it. But you might have too much playing again. You only need like 85. And above that, you really don't get anything really special. In your defense. I mean, the fire difference in the bat is kind of, it's kind of iffy, but I think you can make it work. Your shooting is honestly pretty good, 16 shooting batters without quick draw. You can get four gold badges, which is pretty good, and then your driving is this. When you're like, you, you can't use screens with this build. Because if you use screens, I mean, you could maybe use screens. You don't have a for shooting, which kind of sucks. You could possibly use screens with this build. I swing kind of be hard, because like, drive but if you have really good eyes so where you can get your shot open 
from the three point line, then you'll be pretty good with this build, I'm not gonna lie. All these builds in the top five, you can use them, but I'm just ranking them on how I would um how Good, I think they are. And the number one spot is my 2K21 guard build. So stay tuned. Um, now you can make it 6 7, which I'm so, I, don't, I don't know why they added 6 8. 6 8 is useless. <laughs> it's really useless. But 6 7, you can make him the tallest you can be, uh, lowest weight. I think, yeah, you have to go, you can't go max wingspan. So maybe. And, um,. Yeah, you can go max for 6-6. Six, six. So, I remember I'm actually going 6-6. Six, six. Your 3 ball is kind of better. You get, your dunk is a little better. Your defense gets better. So, 6-6, six, six, max wingspan. And I would recommend choosing the playmaking take. Um, honestly. Or, it helps you out. Slash and take. Now, the next build, at number 3, is all at the top. It's this build. The all blue. This boy, I was doing, um, kind of some invest scanning here. And this build is surprisingly maybe be good, okay? So let me just go into it. Obviously the first one, always. And then this build is really surprising. Now it's one of those builds with a low three ball, which kind of sucks. But you have 11 shooting matters, which is doable. I think it's doable with no, with, you don't have to upgrade search all. It's doable. And then obviously the finish is insane. It's insane. Uh, I want to just get 30 in the process very quick. Now you can have 30. I mean, you can lower this if you want, but I think 30 just get all the back for the playmaking, and you get 14, which is ideal. 14 is pretty good, and then you can your defensive. And hold up, damn. Okay, I'm, 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 I'm gonna take some off over here, so you're not gonna have 30. Um, unless you want to have terrible defense, okay? Let me just take some off. I'm not diving dumb. My it, am, am I dumb? Okay. Can't even offer me that. Okay. So you have three defensive bats, which is not good. You only get clamps, which is not that good. And then I believe you can only make uh you can't make four. You can make a little wingspan, yep. You can make him six three. Yeah, you can make him six three, but your attributes look pretty good, I cannot lie. This is pretty iffy. With only three badges, that's really iffy. You can also you can you can kind of build around, maybe take some driving driving badges, um efficient badges down and look at the defense. Um, make the, your defense better. But honestly, if you can adjust that and make your defense better, better, this build could be pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. You, to, you, to, you can you can speed boost off rip your three ball, nine nine point boost, which I think is in the game, guys. I also not confirmed it, but I think it's in the game because it's copy and paste. That's like to a 66 or 65, which is doable. I think you had like 11 shooting matters. That's pretty doable. This is so amazing. Isolating this build is pretty pretty hard to guard because you can't uh, sit back because your three balls be decent. And then with the dunk, you can literally slam on people. But you're only six three. Also, this build is you're only six three with minimum, minimum wingspan, which kind of sucks. And then I recommend just going such and take with this build. You have those insane uh, attributes for such. Okay, and the next build at number two. This is the safest. Build to make an NBA 2021. 21. And it's shot. This is the safest build, and it's low key, could be a dummy god. So, you choose the first one. This build, man, was really popular last year, and it's been popular mostly for every 2K. It's the safest build to make, man. Um, you can't shoot anything, you take the free throw off a little bit. Um, I should take this post fade off a little bit. Boom. Um, and then you go all way defense because this is a screens build. You can't use contact dunks. This is a purely screens build. It's a screens build. So you have ten defensive badges, which I think you can you you can that's really good. I think you can guard ball. You can't. I mean, you can you can send your man. You don't have to have a lockdown on your team with ten, but you could if you want, just in case maybe like a guy screens and like this one's hard to get over. Well, I'm just. Trying to take the, um, some defensive batters off. Six. The f okay, six. No, no. I'll just, I'll just take this off for now. It doesn't matter. Okay, playmaking, you can't take any playmaking off. And then driving, you could um try to uh, take off some shooting. Or t uh, actually, right here, just take off a few playmaking. 
and you can take off some shooting there and then one defensive badge and then you can go to finishing hopefully get like three shoot finishing badges but this build right here man is pretty good i'm actually going to do that right now i'm trying to adjust it this is kind of like a rework you actually didn't even get finishing badges on this but you still have nine you have uh 20 20 and you got some finishing effort so you're not completely ass in finishing but you can go back to go back to the video and go to what i first made and do that but i just organized it a little bit and then i think you can make him i think he, i don't think you can make him six five you can make him six five uh, i think you can make him, yeah you can make him actually which is really interesting or you can go the safe route go six four which i want to go for now your defensive attributes they're just not good at all possibly a lot nine is so you can get clamps uh, intimidator and interceptor your shooting's amazing with 20 shooting matters and you have 20 filming matters so you got four five hall of fame matters and then you're finishing only have one and you get i think you, you can get a lock take on this one but i think I, I i just didn't um maybe you can go back and just go with the first build i did you can do you can go with lock take i remember doing that or trying to dust to get lock take but for right now i'll go sharp take automatically man sharp take it was op last year trying to take i mean not the biggest fan of but if you're the guy that's fed off screens get this one and the number one point guard build in my opinion i'll be using this build in nba 2k 21 it's my guard build possibly maybe if i get some new build system uh uses 2k 21 um but yeah it's the blue and orange pie chart this one looks really interesting i'm not gonna lie so you go max speed of course um so while i'm upgrading this go there boom you get 21 you get 21 then you upgrade here 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 go to 64 you get six defensive batters which you can get gold clamps and you can choose between intimidator and um, interceptor then you're shooting your shooting is like the two-way slasher last year you can get to 70 with a 99.9 .9, so remember that 79 and you get four gold badges you can get rating center dead eye green machine and um hot 700 and you can also take some attributes off right now um you can't take that off okay so that's there and then you're finishing you go for your finishing and you guys ooh. Oh wait a minute! Wait a minute! I might be doing this wrong. Um, hold up. Why is it? Oh yeah, I know why. Yeah, there we go. Yep, there we go. Um, on, let me just take this one off. There. So I was doing it right about. But here is how it goes. It was 18 fishing batteries. That's enough. You get 12 shooting batteries. 21 playmaking and six defensive. That's pretty good. Offensively, this is a really good build. I still wing. This is a hard build to stop, man. 12 shooting matters is pretty good. You have 18 fish You can get contact dunks. Um, wait, what the hell? Oh, there we go. Now I got 82. I was tripping there. I'm just making sure. I got the highest tripping dunk. So you, you don't have contact dunks yet, but you have 91 ball control, 91 ball handle. I mean. Which is the second highest you can get out of point guard builds besides Peter play. So you go into it, you go solid. You go six five. Six five, because if you go six six, you have to go um negative. So and you don't get driving dogs. But six five here, you still have eighty eight ball control, your driving dog goes up by one, which is key. Uh you go lowest weight, so look at your speed, ninety four ninety three. That's pretty good. And plus the Gatorade boost uh gym rat, so that's pretty good. Then you go max wingspan and look at this. Your shooting goes down a little bit, but 65. And then with a 99 point boost, which I'm pretty sure it's in the game, not confirmed yet, you have a 70 open shot three. With 12 shooting batters, that's doable. Defensive batters, they're looking not terrible. Not terrible. With the boost, you have 80 in those three categories per defense, I couldn't steal. Which is kind of the main attributes of the guard. I mean, block kind of matters. And the defensive rebound is that terrible. And then your ball handle, you'll speed boost off rip which is a w and then your finishing is pretty good as well you can get contact dunks and speed boost off rip with max wingspan and your 6.5 it's pretty glitchy now this is where the hard part is you can go slash and take over which i recommend 
Playmaking team, man, man, you want to get angle breakers, want to help with your teammates. This is pretty good. I don't recommend soccer intake because, yeah, this is not gonna be famous build. But slashing takeover with this build is overpowered. I cannot lie. Okay, so yeah, guys, that is my top five point guard builds. Let me show you what I want, man. Um. I might I'm gonna be playing I hopefully some park. I mean it does um doesn't transfer which means there's gonna be a new build system in MH twenty one um next gen which is amazing. Um but overall, um yeah, and then demo came out uh, I believe yesterday or well, today kind of as I'm, as I'm recording this. And it was I it was overwhelming of course, but it was a demo, anyways, and we're waiting for September 4th to drop. So yeah, guys, hope you all are enjoying the enjoy the vid. I'm sorry, and drop a like. Hope you all enjoy your day. Peace out.